Oh, what is this guy? Oh, he's he's. Oh crap! Okay, he's 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 a boss. He's definitely a boss. He's like holding a bloody hammer and sickle. Oh, okay. Yeah, I do not like him. Okay. Come out this way. He he can probably like do a lot of damage to you. Am I even doing any damage to him? I don't think I am. Okay, this guy looks kind of evil. Well, I, don't, I, I literally don't think I'm doing anything to him. I'm not doing anything to him. Wow. Okay, okay. I just made him mad. I just made him angry. He's running now. Okay. Uh, get, get the hell out. I, I can't see because he's down trees. Greetings, everybody, and welcome to Let's Play Seven Days to Die Alpha 19, modded with Zombie Days. We're now on episode 4. In the last episode, guys, we found this house, and this house was awesome because it had a workbench inside, which means we could actually go ahead and craft some more good stuff. Um, I also built a forge yesterday, so we've upgraded to iron tools, at least for the pickaxe and the shovel, and we got this thing, which is a, uh, a pipe shotgun. Now, this thing can only load one shell at a time, so it's kind of similar to the blunderbuss, but it reloads a hell of a lot faster. So overall, it's going to be a lot more useful than the blunderbuss in terms of just utility and, you know, <laughs> damage per second and raw killing power. Um, seems to be a little bit more accurate as well. Uh, not too much, um, but yeah. Now, the other thing with these pipe weapons um, that was uh, given in the description, is apparently these can break um, if they run out of durability. So we kind of had to keep an eye on durability just to make sure that does not happen, but it's okay. If it happens, then, well, it happens, and that's pretty much all there is to it. So let's go ahead and get started with some more looting. So we've... Uh, kind of arrived right here next to that house because um, I kind of like snuck out at night to build this thing and uh, yeah we're right here so we may as well go and loot this uh, this restaurant here and see what we can find so let's go and have a let's go and have a nosy through here and see if there's anything good just you know waiting around for us because you never know there's five oil right off the bat which is really good so yeah I think what we need to do is we need to essentially start working our way up through the intellect skill tree um, and try and get grease monkey and the workbench one because that will make it super useful and we can then get ourselves a bicycle which is just going to be good all around because it definitely seems like we're going to need a vehicle um in order to really progress too much in this mod so yeah definitely getting around because considering like because when you consider like how far away the trader is as well um yeah we're definitely gonna need some kind of vehicle to get started so let's see how do we even make our way in here and it's like an open window somewhere we can just like barge into or do we have to hack our way in here um, because both doors are locked. Uh, I guess we can just hack our way in. Well, we're at a diner and we're hungry, so, well, there you go. We're, we're in the right place, so I guess we'll just go ahead and smash our way through here. Right, let me kind of duck down here, and I want to see... I want to see how good this, uh, this pipe weapon is, so what we'll do is we'll come around here. I think there's usually some Zeds inside here, yeah. Um, so there's one in there. Is this the only one? Uh, hang on, could I like stand on this thing? There we go. I should be able to get a good view through here to try and pick this guy off. I'll try and use arrows if we can for now, just so I can, you know, pick the zombies off from here. Uh, let's see if I can kind of get up here, get a bit of a better view. There we go. And kind of like there, I think. There we go. Oh, not quite. We're too, slightly too low. There we go. Knock him over again. <laughs> All right, we got gotcha. you. Nice. He's out of here. Right, so that guy is down. So I don't have to worry about you anymore. I do see another one over here, I think. I think I just kind of saw one around the corner. Uh, no, Max, that was a potted plant. Hmm, funny looking zombie, that. Right, anything in here? No one back here? Nope, okay, so this room is empty. Okay, oh. Well, you know what then? We may as well try out the shotgun and see how good it is. Um, so, how much damage will this thing do? Let's kind of let this guy... Let us crawl and get close up, and then one shots it. Very good. I'll definitely take that. All right. How about this guy? Here we go. Nice. All right. So this shot gonna get me out of a jam for definite. Um, you know, one, one shot and down they go. So that works. So I guess that's all the zombies in here. There's really not that many. We actually found a uh, pipe bomb schematic as well, which is really good. So that's gonna help. Um, let's see what we got in here. So you have. An arrow. Hang on, was that a steel arrow? No, it's a stone arrow. I was, I, was, I, I just saw an ST and an arrow. I was like, what, steel arrow? And I was like, oh yeah, wait, 
Stone also starts with ST, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I say stupid sometimes. Um, okay, let's go and have a look in here. Let's go and loot all the things. So we got ourselves a baked potato schematic and a bacon and eggs one. So we can definitely craft those and save ourselves a point of master chef then. Uh, an old lunchbox. So that's used for the nail mines, but other than that, not too much useful stuff. Uh, hello? Who goes there? Alright, how you doing? Get out of here. I'm trying to loot this restaurant, lady. I don't need you coming in here trying to stop me. Stupid lady. Right, let's see what we've got here. Um, we've got Mercury Oil in there, so good for more glue, I guess. I think that's pretty much everyone out here, so let's go out the, go out the side here. And who do we have here? We have an Edgar. What do you want? Come on. Got him. Right, Edgar's out. So yeah, may as well just take care of the zombies as they come in. Let's go ahead and make our way back up here. So there was a ladder just over here, so let's go and make our way up the top. We probably gonna have to deal with the bird, I would have thought. They usually like to spawn up here. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm already hearing one. Any birds coming? Nope, okay. Shocking time! Oh, and we totally missed. Yay! Go on. Oh, we totally missed again! <laughs> I'm doing really well with this weapon. Alright, come on. There we go. Got you that time. Oh, okay. Looks like we don't get um, slowed down for the for reloading the shotgun either, which is really good. Nice. I like this thing. I think this thing is useful. So yeah, we'll definitely uh, definitely keep hold of this. This is a, a is a good weapon. Okay, considering how easy it is to make as well, it's definitely a good weapon. Uh, right, what have we got in here? Uh, any more ammo? Uh, what do we have? We have a Muffle Connect mod. Already got one of those. We can transform those. Three more shotgun shells. Scrap this. Uh, what is this? A pipe wrench. Okay. That's... I don't think we found a wrench already. Oh, no, we did, didn't we? We found a wrench already, but we got a... You know, we've got a pipe one if you want one. A cryo grenade. And I guess since we're not using the blunderbuss anymore, we can just scrap the blunderbuss over, can we? Because we can just get paper out of that and use it for more useful things. Okay, and then arrows, we should be able to get iron ones, so craft those. We can turn our crossbow bolts into iron arrows, and there we go. Right, I think that's pretty much everything up here though, isn't it? Yeah, that's pretty much it, so not too worried about that, so drop down. Um, <laughs> Berser Berserk Bills. Okay, I, I never, I never noticed the name of that before. Hmm. Hmm. Quite, quite, quite the name for uh, for an eating place, isn't it? Berserk bills. Hmm. Is that because when the bills are so high, they drive you berserk? I have no idea. <laughs> Probably. Um, okay, so there's a couple of flags over here. So what is this place over here? I see, a, I see a lot of flags over here. And they all say, uh, they all say White River on them. So hopefully, we're going to find something good over here. Let's see. Um, what is this place? Um, ooh, food and drink, eh? Well, that sounds good, considering we are still kind of hungry. So, oh, hello. Did not see you until, like, last minute. Come on. Food and drink, gifts. Okay. There's too many trees around here. Okay, I'm, I'm literally like, waking up all the zombies here right now, because there's, there's so many trees I can't even see. I, I'm not a fan of these small trees. Right, let me at least get one out of the way. Hello, I guess. Get rid of you. Oh, there we go. We've done some damage to him. Okay, this. Yeah, this this field has way too many trees around it. It's like I can't even see, Captain. All right, let's get rid of this one. I'll let the zombies kind of break their way out. I will clear this so I have better visibility of what the hell is actually going on around me. Yeah, I can't even see like the I can't even see the tree trunk. There's so many. Okay, so these guys are kind of way in the window here. Man, how many how many leaves? There we go. Use that. We can use the shotgun on these guys to help us out of it. Kind of. Wow, I did like nothing. Okay. There you go. Go ahead and uh, get rid of all these guys here. So, yeah, we can weaken them. And then. Oh, 
Oh, I stabbed him right in the butt. Oh, and stabbed that one right in the groin as well. Wow, okay, my character's savage. <laughs> Alright. Let's get him this way. What have you got? Hello, Julie, there. Got him. Come here. There he is, he's done. Oh! She bled out. There we go. I was, wait, another one's coming out this way? What do you want? Got him. There we go. Right, got rid of those guys. Whew! Okay, so those guys have been taken care of. Um, what the hell is there, like, so much foliage? No! Oh, hello! Where'd you come from? He's like, the door? Where'd you think? <laughs> I, I'm sure. I'm sure if the zombies could actually talk in this game, they'd be like, they'd just be telling me how stupid I am. Okay, oh. Wait, I may have wandered into the wrong place. Right, here we go. Okay, we've got two business guys here. Right, got rid of this guy. Okay, now I can make a way back down. All right, we're all good. Okay, come on down this way. All right, no one's down here. Okay, no, we're, we're clear there. Alright, kill this guy. Okay, someone else is down here somewhere. Got him! Got him, he's out of here. There you are! Now I'm gonna slash you with the knife, future girl. Really? This nurse is like asleep, still. Literally, I, there was like a fight going on, and this nurse stays asleep. This builder literally just noticed me as I step on him. Okay, come on. Uh. Okay, oh, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up! Okay. I'm hearing a lot of zombies just like falling randomly. Okay. Where's this bit? There you are. Okay, oh, they're all here, okay. Right, I think, I think they're falling from the upper levels. Okay. Right, really, this thing. Oh, we got him. One. Two. Oh, yes, I like this thing. Three. Counting with Max. Oh, what is this guy? Oh, he's he's. Oh crap! Okay, he's 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 a boss. He's definitely a boss. He's just, like holding a bloody hammer and sickle. Oh, okay, yeah, I do not like him. Okay. Come out this way. He, he can probably, like, do a lot of damage to you. Am I even doing any damage to him? I don't think I am. Okay, this guy looks kind of evil. Well, I, don't, I, I literally don't think I'm doing anything to him. I'm not doing anything to him. Wow. Okay, okay, I just made him mad. I just made him angry. He's running now. Okay. Uh, get, get the hell out. I, I can't see because he's down trees. Okay, get out of here. Alright. So, do, do bullets not affect this guy? Alright, let me try and wait for this guy to come back out here. Okay. I think. Okay, there he is. Um, <laughs> he's going through the queue line. <laughs> okay, hang on. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, he knocks you over. What? What? Oh, God. Oh, run. Oh, run. Okay. Bad. Bad. Very bad. Okay. Take the pain pill. First advantage. Oh wow. Okay, yeah, this guy knocked you down. Oh, that is not good. Okay. Hang on. Kill this guy. Okay, get rid of him. All right, there he is. I, I, I don't know how he can kill this guy. He, he's already recovered. He, does he just recover health? Okay. Yeah, do not get hit by this guy. Yeah, he does. He just, he's just recovering. I, I, I can't I can't kill him I don't think unless I get a ton of pistol shots. Yeah, I I'm doing like nothing to him. I am getting headshot after headshot and it's doing nothing and now he is pissed and he's angry and he's running and I can't run because I'm out of stamina and this is bad. Okay. Yeah, this Yeah, he's he's literally recovering. He's I'm guessing he's immune to bleed damage. Because he is not doing anything. Yeah, okay, hello. 
How you doing? Yeah, that's that's doing nothing. Shotgun shells do yeah, shotgun shells do nothing to him. Hang on, does the pig ice do something to him? No, pickaxes don't do anything to him either. Well, yeah, this guy is like... Arrows? I'm guessing arrows do like nothing to him either. What is this guy's weakness? Is, is, he, li is he literally just like an armored tank dude? That we can't kill? I, th I, th I think we can't kill this guy. Like... Okay, it's, I'm just glad it's not nighttime right now. Yeah, see, he's, he's already just like recovered all that damage we've done to him. That... That is insane. Yeah, we're gonna end up wasting a lot of ammo here, aren't we? Okay, I know it's a favor. Thank you. So we can so we can get this guy. Okay, wait, well, he's. We got, we got a third of his health down. There we go. Okay. Oh. Okay, this, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad. Okay, we're just gonna keep pumping him for the then hopefully he dies. Okay, 675. I don't even know if I've got enough power to take this guy out. Yep, maybe, maybe. Oh god! No, 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 no! Oh crap. No, no, no! No! Run forwards! Run forwards! No! <laughs> we died. <laughs> oh my god, that guy is OP as hell! What the hell? God, we, we knocked us over as he killed us as well. Oh man, that's horrible. Okay, so that guy is like... Okay, that guy is like impossible to kill for us right now. Okay, so note to yourself, if we see that guy again, just don't bother. Um, I'm guessing... I don't know then, I guess, unless you need like armor piercing rounds for that guy, I'm guessing that's what we need for it. That's the only thing I can think of that would do more damage to him, because yeah, literally... I, I have no idea how many rounds I used on that guy. But it was a lot. Okay, so let me go give us the. Oh wait, this is the house of the that exploding dude, is it? Isn't it? I think is it this one. Was it this house? Let me. Yeah, it was this house. So let's just make sure not to do that. Okay. Wow, how how far did I run away from this guy? Oh my god, I can't believe that. Okay, hopefully, hopefully he's not like camping my bag. Otherwise it's just like, it's, it'll be no use. Okay, right, here we go, we got it. Alright! So. I guess that place is off the cards for looting then. So I guess we'll try somewhere else. Well, we're right at a house right here, so I guess we could just, you know, do do right here. Um, all right, let's 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 loot here. Where hopefully the zombies are easier to kill, <laughs> and hopefully my shotgun actually does something to them. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> why? <laughs> why? Why make it so that the weapon I just crafted does nothing? I just, I, that's a that's a real way, real way to to have a sense of accomplishment right there. Is to make it so that, yeah, that weapon you just painstakingly snuck outside to craft does nothing. Hello. Hello, lady. Oh, you didn't, you didn't, wait, you didn't wake up? How did you not wake up? I literally that ran right in there. Okay, hang on, go out this way. Right, so we got this, uh, got this dude here. Let me go here real quick. Oh, that was a, that was a horrible zombie to fight, though. Like, I mean... I can understand like them healing, but like them taking like no damage at all from most things. That's that's just not that's just not fair. <laughs> okay, so we do have landmines here, but let me try and take out that guy. I seen the hang on. I got it. Let me wake him up. Then he can come this way and blow up, blow himself up. There we go. Come on then. 
Oh, no. uh, oh, I was gonna say, I was gonna say, it, it, it looked like he was about to walk around the landmine. So I was gonna be like, oh, of course you'd walk around the friggin' landmine, wouldn't you? Just typical. Um, uh, I hear more of them. Oh, there you are. Just like hanging out here. Okay. Oh wait, there's one. There's one right there. Get back. Get back. Get back. All right, let's try and blow this mine up here. There you go. Blow this mine up. I don't think so. Okay, yeah. That that mine does not want to blow up. Okay, let me just try and shoot this guy back here. Oh, I thought he was gonna blow himself up then. Okay. Oh, I killed him. Nice. Okay. Oh, and she dies as well. <laughs> yes. <laughs> what did she? Wait, how did she even blow that mine up though? Did she like come around this way and then go? In? You know, what? I'm not gonna question it. I'm just gonna be like, okay, that's fine. All right, let's go and take you out then. God, first it's like indestructible zombies, then it's landmines. This this is not my episode. Okay, that, there you go. That's the hashtag. Hashtag, this is not my episode. Oh, and a dog as well? Are you kidding me? Okay, load this thing. Okay, here we go. Okay, oh, I got that guy. Okay, he's out of here. Yeah, th yeah, that, that's definitely the hashtag for this for this one. <laughs> this is not my episode. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Future gear. Now I'm gonna slash my knife in this future gear. There you go, right, she's up. Let me harvest this dude for rotting flesh as well. Okay. Let's get back inside there. Right, we'll go here. Okay, let me let, let me blow that landmine up there from a distance before I inevitably blow myself up on it, because that is exactly what is gonna happen. I can guarantee it. Okay. Right, she's done. Right. Any more landmines back here? No. Okay. I think we're good. Right, let me help this uh, help this guy out here. Get you out of the way. There you go. Right, those guys are out. Okay, so lots of bookshelves in here, which is cool. Okay, we'll loot. I think what we'll do is we'll clear it out first, then we'll loot everything. Because um, it seems like we... Oh, hello. I just ran right past this guy earlier. Right. Oh! Head popping fun, look at that. That guy's down. Okay, ah look, more, more mines right there, see? Man, I just, I can't catch a bloody break today, can I? So, oh, let's just, uh, let's just throw all this stuff at you, yeah, it's all good. God, yeah. Not, not only was the guy indestructible, he had he had knockdown power as well. That's that's just great. Anyone in there? No. Okay, we're good. All right, let's go through here. Hello, hello. Anybody? No, no one here. No one in this room. No, I think we're clearing here. Oh wait, no, we're not. There's a. Okay. Oh no, we're definitely not clearing here. Oh, back up. Oh, okay. Uh, back up this way. Right, come out this way. Okay, yeah, we've we've made him mad. All right, well, we're back here, so I may as well try for some headshots and some arrows to weaken them. Oh, there we go. Okay, this creature girl seems to be a little bit faster than usual. There we go. Take those. All right, we good? Yep. Give you that stone arrow. Thank you very much. Right, let me see. We don't need this uh, quality two stone axe anymore. Let's take this quality three one. There we go. All right, come back through here. Right, yeah, we'll, we'll definitely want to clear this place out before we loot. Purely because there is a lot in here, and yeah, I think I will get distracted too easily if I loot. I don't know, I won't see them. Okay, so I guess this is how we go to get upstairs. Seems legit. Yep, okay. So I guess this is how we come up here. Ah! Nope. 
Oh, my work's showing up over here. Right, she's the only one? Yeah, she's the only one here. Look at that arrow. <laughs> she died in a really weird way, she just like held her arms out. It's like, oh. This guy here. That guy, oh, that guy got that guy got well mad. <laughs> it's like it's like you dare fire arrows into me. <laughs> okay, hang on, this is zombie right over there. Let's go and take you out real quick. Okay. Oh, the blood, the blood is still spurting from the head. Look at that. Anyone in there? No, nope, anyone behind the door? Nope, okay. Right, I bet there's somebody in there. Yeah, just open it up just in case. No, we good? Okay, I think we're good. I think. Emphasis on the word thing. Oh, that's sneaky. They take they painted these ones like regular cupboards so you wouldn't think that's a cabinet. Sneaky! Oh, that was good. Hang on. A target. Can I get a bullseye? Let me see, did I? Uh, oh, I didn't even, didn't even register my arrow hit. There you are. Oh, okay. Got him. Once. Oh, there's a break in the floor there, is there? Okay. So, okay, it's just a bag here. Okay. Random. Okay. Okay. Are you are you are you struggling to get out of the window? Come on. Yeah, you can't get through here, can you? You can't get through here. Oh crap! Okay, you did. Never mind. Oh, okay. Well, he's dead. All right. So what do we have from here? So there's a way. Okay, there's a way through here. No one else in this room? No. Okay. Oh, there's a gun safe in here. Oh, we we still haven't found any lockpicks yet. I guess I could just like perk into lockpicking, and that would help for uh, finding all this. Um, but I don't know. Okay, hang on. There's one right over there I can get. Let me kind of aim up it. Okay. Oh, I got you in the shoulder. Okay. Oh, there we go. I'll take take you out. Over this way. Okay, no one right there. Okay. That's just joke. Oh, hello. Oh, you just came out of nowhere. Down. Alright. Sneaking is off. Let's just kill him. Alright, yeah. well, we don't hear anything. Yeah. Hey, dude. How you doing? Knock this guy out. Right, he's down. Um, oh, there's like a ladder up here. Oh, we're thirsty. Do I have any uh, drink on me, or do we need to go back and get some? Uh, we probably need to go back and get some. I'm getting hungry anyway, though, so let's go and... We're getting hungry and thirsty anyway, so let's go and sort that out a little bit. Because I had to use the bloody painkiller. Oh, no, there's some drink right there. Okay, use these. A few of these should help a little. Okay, come up here. Anything up the top here? Okay, there's like ammo piles and stuff here. Uh, okay, there's another door that goes to the balcony. Gonna find birds out here. There's a way to the roof that way. And there's just some stuff over this way. Okay, so I think that's everything done here, and then we can just kind of go up to the roof from here, right? <laughs> Okay, so we can go up here. There's like a there's like a tower on the top here. Alright. Okay, well I guess we can have a look up here. Right, what is up in the Okay, that is a big bird. Um Okay, that is a that is a boss bird. That is a boss bird. And I'm running away because I've done. No, oh god! Okay, this is not good. Oh, okay. Run and then get inside, get inside, get inside. Okay. Oh my god, he came inside. Okay. Oh no, it was a, a little bird that came inside. Okay, draw down here, draw down here, draw down here. Oh my god. 
Oh my god, he breathes fire at you? What the hell? It's like, like, like a dragon bird? Okay. Oh, he's an electric bird! Oh god, okay, this is bad. Okay, just run, just run, just run, just run. Get back, back, get back, 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 back. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. This is bad, this is bad, this is bad. Okay, try and, try and like, strafe a bit. As he goes, okay. Okay, oh god, and we're dead. <laughs> Why? <laughs> this is not my episode. <laughs> so we have, so we have indestructible zombies, electric breathing birds, that like, okay. Okay, so I guess we can't leave the top floor of that house then. Okay, we can get everything else that was on the floors below, but okay. Electric electric boss bird, I guess, is uh, is something. Okay, let's go. Let's go past the laggy hospital. Let's go get our stuff back. At least we like died outside and not like halfway in a building somewhere. Okay, so how how are we even meant to progress then? Like how how are we meant to kill this stuff if we if we can't get? I I guess what we're gonna have to do. But then it's kind of a question, like where where do you loot? Because that, that kind of boss, that, that electric bird boss, you can't outrun. There's 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 no way you can outrun that guy because he'll just keep he'll just keep coming after you. So that's that's tricky. Like how how to how to do that? Okay, so that boss there we cannot kill. But what we can do is at least we can loot like the the bit of the building we did clear. We can loot that. So that's something. So I guess we'll have to just do that and then kind of come back later with stuff to be able to kill these guys. Damn, that's <laughs> two two deaths in one episode, though. No, that's something. Okay, don't run on the thing. Okay, come here. Kill this guy. Get out of here. Okay. So what have we got here? Okay, so five military parts. Yeah, that's uh, that's something. So yeah, but boss birdies we cannot kill yet either. So I guess we just loot what we can in this house and then like leave the end section till another time when we can actually come back and kill him. Because yeah, right now, right now that cannot be done. I wonder if those boss birds have like a chance to spawn like wherever you wherever you see birds. I don't know, they, they probably do actually, so probably like wherever you would potentially see a vulture or something, you've got, you've got to worry about boss birds too. Okay. Um, yeah, this, this definitely seems, this definitely does not seem in our favour this episode, does it? Okay. Good thing this is not a dead is dead. I don't even know if you could do this dead is dead. Uh, I guess you could if you got really lucky on not finding bosses, but from what I've seen so far, like, this is not even day seven, and we've found like what four different types of bosses now, none of which we've managed to kill. <laughs> I mean, technically, that that armored dude. I if if he didn't if he hadn't got that second hit on me, I probably would have been able to get him down because I ne I almost had him. He was nearly he was nearly out of there. Uh, lucky dude, but let's nice see that. So let's go and loot here, see what we got. See, I I did always have that other guy. Um, because I was just like, yeah, let's just try and shoot him as much as we can. But yeah, this, um, down to seven. What have we got here? Needle and thread. I'm thinking, though, the, uh, the majority of bosses, though, are gonna, are gonna be just like that. They're just gonna be, like, super OP. <laughs> that is, though, that is super OP. It's hilarious. Alright. Um... The, the, the only thing I can say is at least the spiders aren't as bad. Like, I would have thought the spiders would have been pretty bad, but they're actually not. They're not too bad at all. I mean, they jump at you a bit and spit webs at you, but that's about it. So it's not too bad. Not that bad. Alright, let's see what we've got in here. Um, but yeah, I, I definitely need some better weapons. But where I can get those without being able to loot for them, I don't know. Oh, hang on, I can pick up landmines. Oh, okay. 
Well, in that case, I, okay, I, I won't bother blowing them up from now on. I'll just pick them up. There we go. Kind of sorts it. What is that on the wall there? Hang on. Is that. Oh, hang on. There's a hidden bit right there. Okay, give me that, wasn't it? Uh, a cat! Okay. Let's go and loot through here, see what we get. Okay, yeah, so we, we, we need to find a way to be able to upgrade our weapons. Um. Or at least be able to like get a lot more ammo a lot more quickly. So I'm I guess we're gonna have to like we have to do a lot of mining. That's what I'm thinking. We're gonna have to do a lot of money for a lot of gunpowder, and then try and find a try and just find some workarounds to get better weapons sooner. I mean the trader is obviously the easiest route. Like I said, that trader is so far away. That by the time we get there, we'd have probably run into like ten more bosses on the way. Um, because it seems they just, they just spawn anywhere. So, yeah, it's one of those things. It's one of those things, like, do we, do we try and venture to the trader, or do we just kind of stay around here and loot what we can? It's, it very quickly seems like we are running out of places to loot that doesn't have something in that wants to immediately kill us. I mean, yeah, there's, there are all the POIs have zombies in them, but at the same time, at least those are zombies we can kill. Whereas this one, I mean, yeah, we 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 had no chance against that bird thing, no chance. I can't I can't believe we survived one wave of attacks from it and then we died on the second one. But yeah, we had like yeah, there was there, there was no way we could have could have lived that. Okay, wait, why am I using a, an axe? I have a pickaxe for a reason. <laughs> it makes the work go like much quicker. Who'd have thought? Okay, there we go. So you can just kind of shortcut our way into this room real quick. Because there's more bookcases and stuff in here. Let's see what we've got in here. We have, what's this one? A 5 Zalmanac Volume 1 for 5 in gear. And Shotgun Duckfield Muscle Manic, okay. I will take all those. Let's see what we have here. Um, okay. Uh, okay, we can turn these into iron arrows. Scrap these. Alright, so we got some more water here. Okay, so at least we get more water for glue, because we'll need that for duct tape later anyway. I wonder about those um those fire arrows then. Uh Wild Wasteland Volume 5. Zep, you have learned how to increase the damage output of the uh of the alien blaster. Hmm. Alien blaster, eh? What's that? Ah, oh, we can't we can't make it then I guess. Uh Ailey No calipers Silent Light No, can't do any of that. Okay, so we can't we can't make it, so I guess that's something we have to find only. Hang on, so what what guns are available for us to use? Hang on. I gotta check what we have. So we got combat bows, um we've got the regular kind of vanilla guns. Um, is there any new ones that we can make? Um, what have we got? So we got uh, Lincoln's Repeater Maria, which is a type of pistol, I guess. Uh, Le Fusil Terrible. Uh, Ashmaker, which I'm guessing is a flamethrower. Okay. Um, Arizona Campaign Scout Rifle. So I'm guessing all these need schematics. Yeah. Okay. There's a lot of um, a lot of new types of special guns. I guess. So I guess these are like legendary ones. Um, a trap nail gun and a super nail gun. Okay. So we do have a few do have a few um, legendaries in here, which is pretty cool. Um, a military tier shotgun though. That'd be uh, that'd be pretty good. I I, I definitely want that. Uh, Lingers repeater, unique variant of the lever action rifle, hits harder and can penetrate more targets as well as its member them. Has a variable zoom on the iron sights. Ah, okay, that's cool. So we got a couple of a uh, couple of cool rifles here. And Desert Eagle, unique variant of the nine mil pistol, hits harder and can dismember targets. Okay, so yeah, there's a couple of a uh, couple of cool weapons in here that we can uh, potentially make later. Um, hang on. Uh, work on drilling machine description. Shotgun microfusion cell? 
Hmm, okay. I I have no idea what those are. Okay, yeah, you need batteries to make this. Oh, wait, you need, like, batteries to make those things? Okay, so yeah, there's a lot, a lot of different types of guns and ammo in here, but yeah, as, as to which... As to which I can use right now, well, not many, so... I'm gonna have to come up with another way to be able to take on bosses and things, because... That's the problem. With the, with the puking birds as well, the problem is with those is they, they don't come down to the ground and like try and attack you the same way as regular birds do most of the time. They kind of stay up high. So, because what I do with the... If it was like a regular bird kind of thing that was like harassing me and I couldn't kill it, I'd try and lay spikes down or something and then have it fly into them to get trapped and then I can deal more damage to it without worrying about you know it killing me so easily. But with those kind of birds... I mean, you can't really place spikes in the air because they just fall down, so it's a little bit harder to come up with a solution for that. Okay, what do we got here? So we got ourselves scrap leg armor, gloves, what's in the toolbox? Anything in there? Forge iron. Okay, I'll take those. That's not bad. <laughs> that was funny though, just like, like literally just see that thing pop into existence. That was a that was, that was that was a fun time. A fun time was had by all. Especially the bird who got who got to eat me. So you know, he's he was happy. We had a happy bird. Not a flappy bird, or an angry bird. But a happy bird. Okay, so let's grab all these. So we do have some survivor notes here. In here we have the first advantage. Nice, I'll take that for definite. <laughs> Definitely gonna need that. Okay, and then some turrets here. Alright, there we go. Can I dig out of here? I, I'm just dreading what ha what happens on Horde Knight then, because if those if those guys are gonna appear on Horde Knight, I've got no chance. Like base or not, I've got no chance. <laughs> So I have no idea. I have no idea what to expect on the whole night at this point, because it's just like, okay, yeah. If if that if those if those guys show up, then yeah, that's that's that. <laughs> They're just like, <laughs> do you, you may as well just like try and dig a hole and hide in it at that point. Which would be a strategy that I've never really done, but it would be funny. Oh, okay. Just land on land on the metal spikes. That's 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 a good idea. Because everyone knows how healthy landing on metal spikes is for your butt. Especially me, because I'm a spike tester. So, you know. I give those spikes a 9.5 out of 10. I'm now adorned with three extra assholes. That's, uh, that's, that's great. Right, so... It's pretty much all that's in that house there. So yeah, we're definitely not going to go up the top of that, of that one then. So where else do we go? <laughs> I don't know. There's like every building now. Things seems like okay. There's just gonna be something horrible in it. So I'm wondering. I'm wondering what the hell we're gonna do now, really, because it's like okay. So we've looted most places. There's another place here we can go in. Oh wait, no. This is the. No, that's the place we don't want to go. Okay, we don't want to go in that one because that had the indestructible guy in there. So, so where, where exactly can we go here? So there's burnt by him that way. Okay, we haven't been down this way. Okay, let me go. Let me go over this way. We haven't been over here. So let's go ahead and have a look and see what is over this way. Because yeah, this, this way we haven't really been to, and it looked like there was some kind of building over here based on what I can see on the map, so yeah. Let's have a look over here and see what we can find. Um, so over here we have... What is this place here? Is this a Dragon Messiah? Oh. Okay, just a zombie over there. Okay. I, th I thought something was like bounding towards me then. I just like heard loads of rustling of leaves. I was like, oh god! It's like, what's approaching me now? And luckily it was only this guy, so... Not so bad. So there we go, it's all good. Um... Okay, so what is this place? Oh, okay, this is a passing gas. Okay, this one we might be okay in. May maybe, maybe. Um, I, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. We're probably gonna die. Ah, let's just do it. Let's just do it. We we died a ton of times already, so it, it really doesn't matter at this point. Let's see what we got here. So five. 
Uh, bits of fever. Go then. What are you doing? Here are you. Right. Let's go around here and see what we can find here. Hopefully we can actually find... I'll tell you what would be good if we did find. Um, some vehicle parts. That would be a very good find. And actually what I could technically do... Hello. What I could potentially do then is if we do manage to find those, um, we could make schematics for the vehicle parts rather than have to invest uh, the points into it. Alright, what's in here? We have rifle parts. Go in here. Anyone in here? Yep. Random business here. Alright. Why is there a shower box here? This is the passing gas, damn it. I came here for passing gas boxes. That's your cruddy excuse for the passing gas boxes to turn out to be shower boxes. I didn't come for those things. I'll take them though. Alright, so nothing really much back there. Let's just go and open all this stuff out. Lots of cobble in here, too. I guess that's why. Yeah, there you are. Yeah, stay away from me. There we go, there's the thousand gas boxes. Right, okay. Are there any deadly birds on the roof? Any, 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 any boss electric dragon things? Anyone at all? You may as well just come out now if you're there. No, just got regular zombies here. Okay, well, there we go. Okay, go this way. Putrid gears. Now I'm gonna slash you with my knife. Putrid gears. Now I'm gonna slash you once again. Putrid gears. Why did you have so much food on you? Putrid girl. You should have just got to take away. Putrid girl. At least then you wouldn't have to go future girl. Okay. Right here. There you go. Grab this bag up here. Okay, slow it here. Alright, so we've got a little stuff up here. I think there's a couple of boxes up here. Yeah, there is. Okay, let's have a look at it. So this box, what do we have? Hopefully loads more ammo. So we got ourselves 10 more rounds. A level 4 cleaver, which is better than my level 1 knife, so we'll definitely take that. Oh, well, I think I'm, I'm finally about to be over encumbered here. What is this? Uh, a rolling pin. Wow, we can we we can we, we can cack zombies with a rolling pin now. That's awesome. Um, okay, I'm probably not going to use this. Let's just grab that. I'm probably... It does less damage than the knife does. So let's just yeah, just let's let's just with the with the amount of stuff that's killing us right now, we we, we can't afford to just like mess around. <laughs> We have to find some seriously good weapons and quickly. If we have any hope of making it past day seven. Alright. Well, we got some thousand gas boxes here, so let's have a look in here. Right, hopefully there'll be like some wheels or a chassis in here or something. Uh a, a iron tool schematic. Uh we already know it, so yeah. Uh, a tier a tier four stone tool though, so that's better than my current tier three. <laughs> And we can't scrap something for some reason. Oh, because we've got, of course, brass scrap. I'm going to have to look into why brass takes like so long to scrap. Because that's, it's like every 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 other metal, it's like, yeah, you, you want to scrap it. And it's like, okay, per unit of metal, it's like a tenth of a second. Whereas per brass, it's like ten times longer. If you're going to get like a, if you're going to get like a hundred brass, it takes like a minute and a half. It's like, why does it take so much longer just for brass? It's like, I get that it's using bullets and stuff, but like, so is lead. And that doesn't take so long. It's just weird. Alright, so what's in here? Anything good? In here we have... what is that? That is a... a tire iron. Yeah. Okay. So is this... does this operate a bit like a club or something? I like... ooh, hello. Yeah, I guess it's just uh I guess it's just some kind of club type weapon. By the looks of things. Okay, let's get the cobblestone from here as well, because we do have some cobble pallets to grab. Uh, one of the bunga forms, I have no idea. Yeah. Bonus hashtag bung.fox. <laughs> Alright, let's go and move all the stuff up here. Okay, so we've got a couple of uh, couple of good things in here. 
but other than that, we didn't find any vehicle parts, which is a shame, because that's that's kind of what I was hoping for. I was like, okay, if we find vehicle parts, at least that way, um, we would be able to assemble the vehicle sooner, but no such luck. Is there anything behind here? I guess there is. A bag with some survival notes. Yeah, we're going to have to see how many survival notes we got. Because, yeah, if we can make the workbench and then also maybe do the, the bicycle one. Because um, we did. I think we found handlebars. We just need the chassis. Um, we do have acid for the tyres already, I believe. So, I think as long as we find that, we should be good. And then we can make our bicycle really quick. What vending machine is this? Uh, sunset. Oh, oh okay. It's one, of the, one of those sunset ones. Okay. Right, so there's some shelving here. Can we loot any of this? Yep, what's in here? We have paper! Hooray! Paper! The best kind of loot! That's definitely what we always never wanted. <laughs> it's the one thing you never knew you always wanted. Right, golden rod. What's in here? Uh, okay, canned foods. It's, it's kind of a good thing that food is easier to come by in this mod, just because of the sheer op of the bosses. It kind of thinks... Uh, it kind, of, it kind of makes you think like, yeah, if, if you had to worry about food and stuff a lot on top of that, this would just be a much more stressful mod. Like, it, it, this feels fun, even though, like, we're dying a lot, because it's like, okay, we kind of get to go in, get some decent loot, and then we don't have to worry too much about this. It's, it's more like we don't have to worry so much about the survival aspects in terms of, like, managing our stats in this mod, which is, in, in a way, for this style of mod, it's a bit like a, it's a bit like um it's a bit like AIO as well. For for these style of mods, it's actually pretty good to, I guess, have less of an emphasis on the survival side. It kind of balances out nicely that way. Okay, shotgun shells that do nothing to indestructible bosses, mind you. <laughs> so it's like, yay, we got shotgun shells. Yeah, they, these shotgun shells do nothing. Yay, they do nothing. Okay, so I guess you can just describe this. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, are we hungry right now? Because I'm kind of getting full here. Yep. We're getting hungry, so... Let's go ahead and grab a few of these. Alright, there we go. And there is one shamway box right here as well, so let's go have a look in there. What do we have in the Shamway box? We have a lot of drinks and some honey. And a potato. Just just because the potato, but they, the potato just like, wanted to be there. He, he just wanted to be included. He's like, I want to feel special too. Alright, grab that. And we have a can. Can you believe that? You can. <laughs> right, so we got that one. And Oh yeah, we actually found a treasure mine, didn't we? Let's, uh... yeah, let's read that one up. So, set that one. Uh, ooh! Treasure maps give me red text. Uh oh. Well, it did give me red text, but then it's kind of still popped up on the map here, so... How far away is that? Oh, that's not too far, so... Yeah, we could go and dig that in the next episode. Because at this point, guys, once I've done this, I think we'll be at a pretty good point to go and end off this episode, because we're almost, uh, we're almost done um, with this place. And we have been going on for a little while, so we go ahead and just loot this one. And there we go, got some balls here. I had to see what that, those balls are used for. Um, I'm sure they're useful for something, and I'm sure it's going to be like really good food of some description. But yeah, there we go, guys. We have done the passing gas pretty much. There's a couple of cars and stuff, but you know, we're just going to probably not find anything too amazing in cars. You never really do. But yeah, see. <laughs> I want to feel the schematic, what we've had in the car. So yeah, nothing, uh, nothing too special. All right then, guys. Well, I think yeah, I think that's a good point. Then we can go ahead and end off the episode. So I'm gonna go ahead and do it right here. We did find a tech junk going by, so I'll read that before we do. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this one, and I'll see you guys in the next one. So till then, bye.